light that flame, put on that oven, put on that apron, and let's go. Good afternoon once again to Fryer Chef. This afternoon I have one of our fryers who is a really good little chef. Uh, he's going to make some meatless soups for this Lenten period. The first one that Father Julian, who works at the Migrant Center, is going to make for us is an egg drop soup, which is delicious. And I hope you enjoy it. Julian? take it. This is my version of egg drop soup. I've been preparing egg drop soup with the fryers or for the fryers and I found out that they really love my version of egg drop soup. As you can see we almost have three dozens of eggs here because we're preparing for 20 fryers in the house. You don't have to prepare this much eggs if you're only preparing for a small number of people. But here, we have about 20 fryers in our house who love this delicious egg drip soup. Now, we add salt and pepper on the eggs and we whisk it and we mix it. And we also add olive oil so that the eggs will not clump together. And you whisk it so much so that it gets to a more creamier look for the eggs. And then you dilute chicken stock paste with hot water. You can also use chicken stock in a can or a box, but I prefer this one because it tastes different. And you have to make sure that it is completely diluted in hot water. They experience it, a paste version of chicken stock is thicker than the one that you can find in a box or, or a can. So you dilute it in hot water. And, some, and most often I would taste the consistency of the soup. Now that water is boiling, you add your mix of eggs in a boiling water with chicken stock. And sometimes you need somebody to help you stir it consistently because you don't want the eggs to clump together. And you stir it, stir it more, and you can smell the, the olive oil that's mixed with the eggs. And then you add fresh chives and you complete continue to stir it and stir it until all the taste the texture and the aroma are completely mixed in together and voila you have delicious egg drop soup thanks julian that was great. I hope you got that recipe. It's not a difficult one. That's why Julian can do it. <laughs> but it's a wonderful, wonderful recipe. And as you can see, I finished it all. So I hope you come back for our next show where Julian will do again another Lenten meatless soup, a shrimp soup, which is superb. Good to see you. Love you. See you soon. Bye-bye.